Hello students, so let's try to solve this problem. This problem is from group theory and this is a very simple and straightforward question. What is this question? So there is the, this is given that the, the regular representation of two non-identity elements of group of the order 3. So it's just very interesting and this is just a straightforward question. So what we have, we have the group which has order 3 and if it is the order 3 that means if the two group will be non-identity, then third must be identity. And if we are taking the matrix multiplication as my operation, because this is just a matrix representation of a group. So if we are talking about the matrix multiplication, then the whatever the matrices given into the option, if we are doing the multiplication, after the multiplication, it must be identity. Because identity must be the element of group. This is the very necessary condition of group. So what we have to do? We have to just multiply these two elements, multiply these two elements and we have to check whether they are identity or not. So you can multiply all these things. So you can multiply this thing. I am just going for the correct option. So let's try to multiply these two things. This is the option number 3. So what is option number 3? We have option number 3. 0. 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0 and you will just have second element is 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1 and 1, 0, 0. So what will happen? The first element is 1, the second and this element is 0, this element is 0 and again we are going to this element is 0, this element is 1 and this element is 0 and here 0, 0, 1. So yes, this is identity element. So just you can see that option number 3 is correct. But you have to just multiply all these options. So don't multiply completely in the examination. You have to just take, see that first element is 0, is 1 or not. If it is not 1, then obviously this is not going to be identity. So you can just do the quick calculation for each and every option. So for example, the first element is 0 in first option. So obviously it is not going to be identity. For given the second option, again you can see the first element itself is 0. So again this is not identity. And yes, we have just calculated this one. This is also identity. And the fourth element you can just check the first uh, uh, multiplication. You can check that first element is not 1. So it is also not arranged. So there is no need to multiply all 3 cross 3. You can just check the first element because first element must be 1 for the identity matrix. And once for the sure sort calculation, once you will getting the first element is 1 into the option number 3, then obviously you can have uh, uh, just go to the next level of calculation. So it's a very interesting and second thing is all about that these two elements is the inverse of each other because in a group you have identity element and there must be inverse element. So if you will check these two will be inverse because the A operation B is giving identity. So one will be inverse to the another one. So it's a very simple group, very straightforward group and obviously this is order of three. So yes, the three element will be, the, this is your first element. You can say this is your A1, this is your A2 and this will be your identity element and they are just forming the group. So you can also check whether they are abelian or non-abelian. So you can just go for this particular calculation. Thank you.